One, two, three, four times. Stop playing with me, bro. Fuck wrong with you. Yup, yup, yup. So. Yay. Uh, talk to me about Kanye. What's going on with your boy Kanye, man? Oh, my goodness. You the rap fan, so talk to me about Kanye. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> First of all, I want to give a shout out to myself for calling it that he wasn't going to be with old girl for long. I don't know if y'all remember me saying that. Yeah. Y'all like, nah, she bad though. She bad. No, nah, nah, I, like, I ain't never said oh, she on Julia? Fox. No, I didn't. Y'all, I said y'all, y'all did say she was bad. Y'all did, but y'all also said old girl he was no, with Julia. Movie. First off, we're not going to flex like Julia. First off, she's in her seasoned age. So she, she if you're talking about like when she was in Uncut Gems. And shit like that, like that's not even her prime, but like her prime, she was bad. Should have got bad. with a Julia from Transformers. That's the one he should have been with. Who? The Julia from Transformers. What's, what's I don't one? know her last name. I thought that was Megan Fox. Yeah, yeah it was Megan Fox. My bad. <laughs> 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 she would. She would. He should have got with Megan Fox. She would. She got Kelly. My bro. bad. I don't know why I'm thinking <laughs> Julia Fox, <laughs> Megan Fox. Like I don't know. But how have y'all seen Uncut Gems? How you just taking? Machine that? Gun Kelly girl. Uncut Gems is a movie with Adam Sandler, Adam Sandler, and she's in it. Julia Fox. Oh, that's where he's a jeweler. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The I girl, seen the girl, the girl, the his girl in the movie who's super bad. That's her. She like in her lingerie and shit, booty, fat, fat, fat. Oh, that's I her. Know that. Yeah, mm. that's her. All I'm saying is, but no, she was so arguing on Instagram about no, meth. So. No, but also that shit was a fabricated relationship. She basically talking about it right now. Like she said. She literally came out the other day and said parts of their relationship were real. So, I mean, you're probably talking about sex, sex and yeah. dates and shit. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? But He bought okay, a whole team Birkins. Kanye is going out super sad. And the only reason that it's acceptable is because it's Kanye West. And I hate to say it, but it's the honest truth. But I think the fact that Kanye is famous is making us as a, uh, I don't want to say it. I don't know if you want to say country because our whole country know who Kanye is. But us as a whoever the hell fan base, anybody that pay attention to Kanye, this man has mental health issues, bro. Like, for real. And I don't know if y'all watched the uh, ye, uh, gen, ye, Genius. Yeah, Genius shit, which I haven't watched it, but I've seen like parts of it. It's like his mom, like I've read reviews on it and shit too, and it's like his mom was like, his like safeguard, you know what I'm saying? Probably and once the only and one, that could tell him not to do crazy exactly, shit he, he was making sure he took his med. Like he was listening to her. <laughs> and once she passed away, and you gotta think about it. Once she passed away, and now he really dealing with a divorce and shit like that. He don't know how to deal well, with well, it. Well, bro, geniuses always are when you, diff- like yeah. are different. You know what I'm saying? And it takes a lot to deal with them, and it's a rough slide to be on. But at the same time, I have a hard time. Looking at a motherfucking going, you don't even think that's a little bit strange, bro. Like, no, it's a super dude. Just the fact that he's not even a little bit. The, just the fact that, okay, bro, I don't give a fuck who you are. If you my boy and you just got divorced, and you were like, yo, bro, I'm moving the car. My girl got a, a new dude, but I'm moving across. The, I bought the house across the street. I'd be like, for what? Like, what you mean? He'd be like, oh. I bought the house across the street to stay close to the kids. I'd be like, nigga, that was the only house for sale. Like, it wasn't. Your girl got a new dude, and you finna be across the street, like, looking out the window type shit. Like, dog. You, that, that. See, Jack, he made Pete Davidson get offline. No, fuck that. <laughs> no, 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 bro. He got him off. His fan base. He got him offline. So dog, there's, like three, there's like three rappers that got crazy fan bases. Kanye West, Young Boy, and Playboy Cardi. Mm-hmm. Their fan bases are like. You got, you got another one. Who? Travis Scott. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. That's a good stupid. one too. That's that a good one too. That Dua Lipa chick, she got some. She got a crazy Doja Cat too. I didn't know her family was as crazy yeah, as they that are. Shit big too. But bro, the fact that Kanye, this man Pete Davidson, joined Instagram and his whole fan base was trolling him so bad that he quit like the same day. Then this man made the music video of him kidnapping Pete and burying him, bro. <laughs> I had this seen man it. Kanye is wild, <laughs> bro. But let me tell you though, let me. It's speak. his world. We just let me, living in it, bro. Let go, dog. Bro, God, it no, for real though. Like the thing is, I, I after watching the Genius documentary, I can't even call Kanye crazy. I literally respect his art, his vision, and literally how he thinks in regards to. The way he moves and literally once you watch it, you'll have so much respect for him because I feel like everybody should think and move. And the thing that's so touching for me 
And the thing I respect it is because if you about to say everybody should think and move like Kanye, I'm gonna need a, a bigger yeah. class than this. <laughs> no, the thing is like his mom Donda. I hope every person born has a mom like that. Literally, once you watch the documentary, it'll change your perspective. And with you being an artist, and you'll look at it and you'll be like, okay, I can I can relate to this or. This is how I should start moving in different things because it'll give you a different appreciation of how he thinks. And I feel like everybody should think like that and literally have that confidence. And the quotes and the different things that they have, his team that surrounds him as he coming up, you'll be like, it'll make you rethink your circle and people that surround you and stuff like literally. And honestly, I, I suggest you watch, <clears throat> excuse me, because you're an artist, but it, it'll make you tap into not the, the worldly things that we see every day. But it's like, like a different side of you. A different shit. side or, of you. Your music. But still, like it, it, it'll bring out the best in you as far as your music and stuff. Yeah. And the thing I respect and literally look at it in regards to what's going on with what he got now and different things. That's Kanye. That's him. But once you watch the documentary, you understand like how he moved, the way he moved, and what he's doing. I see why they call it genius because it's like. It's, it's it's different, man. Like it, it just it it bring a different side of you. Like even if you're not in music, like for me, it channeled me to be like, okay, fuck it. You only got one life to live. Go get that shit. Like once you get shit for yourself and you do it by yourself and no help, then you realize like I'm a dangerous motherfucker. Like I I can do this shit. Yeah, but I also feel like Kanye. Okay, like the word crazy, the word crazy and genius to me. This is just my opinion. I think them shits are synonyms. And let me tell you why. They go hand in hand, They though. go hand in hand, bro. Listen, Kobe Bryant, this nigga's work, worth ec, work ethic was crazy. That's my nigga. But Insane. Damn, I missed my guy. But listen, but, but Kanye, listen, Kanye. No, 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 listen, listen. What I'm saying, Kanye has Kobe, two man. sides of crazy. Kanye has a crazy when he's in the studio making his music. You're like, yo, that's crazy. Like, that's a good crazy. Like, oh, my God, that's crazy. That's his mind at his best work. Now, when he walk out the studio, is the bad side of the crazy. <clears throat> this man don't know how to act with with him. I Let mean, me, no, shit like, no. you know see, what I'm see, and this is why I have a problem with when we go that route. I feel like we're making excuses for him because he know how to act well enough not to get his ass arrested. Yeah, not to get in no trouble. He's not doing nothing. To what do you mean? But what do you mean? That's not okay. But no, no, no. Because look, I think that's a different type of crazy. No, 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 no. Because if you're Kanye West and you're talking about getting arrested or doing anything to risk your career, your money, now you're trying to measure crazy. Real crazy people don't have no control. That's the point of causing them crazy. That's why we get them medication. That's why we gotta watch them. I have a cousin. He crazy for real. Ain't no no whether cops around, whether I'm around, whether whoever around. Kanye, no. To me. What I see, and personally, this is just me, to me, it's all publicity. Kanye does everything that he does for a certain level of attention, which garners him that attention. And there's enough lonely weirdos out there. The world is full of weirdos, bro. Facts. There, there, there's, no shortage, facts. there's no shortage of a weirdo out there looking for somebody to relate to. Because the fact of the matter is, is this. When you start to understand that like the top 1% is 80000 and up, that shit, once you hit 80000 you like, this shit don't seem like a lot of money to me. You know what I'm saying? Or, or when we, we was all athletes, y'all don't realize that that was the top 1% of the school. Yeah. You, don't, you, you, you don't think about these things, right? So yeah. then think about all the kids and all the people who were never at, quote unquote, the cool kid table, who never go to the club and be Thanks. like at, popping a bottle or something like that. We don't think like that because that's our lives. Yeah. All right? So them people out there living vicariously through a Kanye and always willing to give him a pass. And I would give it, agree with you, Ye, but I've seen too many stars get passes while other people get. I, I watched Chris Brown give Rihanna the Hadouken in a fatality move in a car, have her in a hospital, bit up. And, and, and no knock on Chris Brown, because if she like that, I love it. That boy with the ball in the one yard no. line in the Super Bowl. Bro, <laughs> but listen, but listen, right? <clears throat> women power, women movement. His fans are all women. They forgave him for that, because that's how fickle society is. Yeah. They, they they don't believe nobody really believes the shit that they be saying. That's why I like Kanye to me. Like I say, it's publicity. You telling me that Kanye thought that he that Kim Kardashian was the one for him? You mean the chick making the sex tapes? You mean lie, the chick bro. who smashed everybody in the rap game? Them them. So 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 you telling me that Kanye is such a genius that he couldn't figure out that damn, I'm marrying a woman who get around more than Tupac. But so Q. I can't. 
I, but Q, <laughs> but think about this though. Oh, I'm the thinking industry, the industry that he in though, who have been passed around. That's 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 my point number one. Who have been passed around? Like literally, that's point number one. There's stars then, that are marrying regular people. Look, yeah, look at look at then, OBJ. OBJ is a star, right? Look what he did. Shout out to OBJ, by the way. He OBJ, he didn't marry a normal person. Stop, stop, stop. No, stop. He didn't normal. He didn't stop. marry a normal person. Yeah, she, she pretty damn normal. No, what the she fuck do? she not? What, what, what does she do? She's a fucking Instagram. Okay, influencer. so she's a model and or or, or but that's not a normal but person. She's not. That's pretty damn. Please, any cute girl can be an influencer. No, bro. bro, not any cute girl can have the amount of followers that she has. Listen, there's a difference between her and fucking Kim Kardashian. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. So I mean, bro, Kim Kardashian is the top 0.5 percent. My point though, he went out, he cuffed him one early, super early. He seen on it. Hey, so you went cuff Kim Kardashian and she tried to come talk to you? Not in a million years. Would I knock her down? Man, crazy hell. Would I knock her down? That's a different story. Hey, let me tell you but why I, I would cuff her. A Kim Kardashian and what for what to pretend like what? Kim Kardashian and Pete Davidson got another year and a half before she on to somebody else. And we know this. We know this. Who want to bet money on it? I wouldn't even. Give I, that who line. wants to put money? You on said it? longer Pete than Davidson that. About to Bruh. Be. I know it. Pete Davidson got a year. Not even that. Honestly, I ain't gonna even lie. The reason I love Kim Kardashian is because she a businesswoman, bro. Her business first. That's fine. You can love her. That's why she left Kanye. But you don't marry her. That's why she left. Well, besides the kids and, and not spend enough time, but she left Kanye because it was a smart business move for her. But you don't marry. But her, her kids and stuff. Too. I would. I would have married her. I wouldn't have no trouble. Not even because of her track record or the the miles she got on her cat or any of that, bro. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day. She literally, her family. I don't know if if if, if you know Armenian like their Armenian, morals yes, and I values do. and ways. I do. I was in Cali. But the I thing is, her family, their values and different things is based around family. And literally, I don't know their story or what went down or whatever. But literally, Kanye should have been there for her when she needed him, and he wasn't. He was out in Wyoming at his house. And if you actually watch the Jesus thing, it's like. Where's Kim? Where's Kim? Like, it, it make you think, like, literally, like, where the kids at? Like, so, you know, I I, I want to see more in depth. Like, if I have four kids by a influencer, Instagram model, any of that, somebody, like, around a Kim Kardashian type, I'm going to balance out my career and my family. Because I'm going to put my family first. Even that's in the Bible, though. Clyde, they they you. said, like, like, literally, like, literally. That's and it, easier it, it, said than done. Clyde, I feel you, bro. No, no, no. They, like, Clyde, you're 100% you're correct. But if you're thinking, but you can't like that, tell me you would not date a. You can't tell me you would, you would not I, marry listen, Kim Kardashian. I would not bro. marry Kim Don't Kardashian. Don't lie, bro. I swear. Listen, on my life, I would not marry Kim Kardashian. Boy, crazy hell, it right? is a waste of your Ain't time. Even about look for me. Uh, unless you just listen. If you're doing it for the money or something like that, then that's cool. No, don't, <laughs> don't, don't, don't. I hope the camera ain't catching. I ain't that. seen that one. <laughs> don't. No. No. You know who it is. No, nah, it was it low. No, I said I ain't seen that one. In listen. <laughs> This is my I point. No, CJ. Go ahead. Go ahead. We can talk. Yeah, yeah you almost slipped You up. can't talk family with a Kim Kardashian, dog. It don't make... All right, let's put, let's put it this way. If you look at Kim Kardashian and her past and her sisters, what... This is how I am. This is all I am. I'm a very simple man. I just follow trends. Like if the stock market... If, if, if there's some stock that's been going down for three years, I'm not hopping in. I'm not going to throw my money in it. Kim Kardashian make money. Her money side of it, listen, she's a genius, all that, money maker. But relationship-wise, you got to be able to put people in the brackets. Like, it, that, that's like, I, I, I try and tell people that all the time, like Cam Newton. Think about Cam Newton. Cam Newton, great football player, right? He should have never got his ass on no mic in front of no camera. He done said some of the dumbest damn things. No, nah, let me tell you. Just, just stay off of it. But 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 the point well, he is, he said to Britney though, or bracket was real though. He was Britney like, I don't want to end up in your. I don't know if you if y'all follow uh, Cam Newton podcast or whatever. Or I know what you're talking about. Uh, I just I didn't know he had one till today. Yeah. I saw. It. He's better on but the it's podcast. Cool, though. Than he was it's cool for his though. interviews. His interviews cool. for NFL was just like it's cool. But horrible. If you go back and watch the, I, I put it, I put it in our group message. But literally, if you go back and watch the interview with him and Britney Renner, that. Is somebody that you gotta be careful with. Oh, but so you gotta be careful time? with Britney Renner, but you all right with Kim Kardashian. What's the difference other than Britney took money? No, nah, but see the thing is, Britney and, and I and I ain't gonna lie, I love Britney like literally and I respect her. But the only difference between her and Kim Kardashian is literally is Kim got more money. No, it, Kim Kim business wise and her fans, her marketing and everything affects and touches everything she does. 
Britney Renner doesn't have that following like Kim Kardashian does. They she both- doesn't have a TV show worth a multi-million dollar thing on E. She doesn't have her own clothing line that's worn by neither one of them. Are the, women. the only thing they have in common is literally probably body counts and no disrespect, but literally probably body counts and different things. But the thing is, Cam Newton said the thing when they were asked about like, hey, Brittany, you come to Atlanta, you hit Cam Newton up trying to hang out and stuff. I'm going de- to respectfully decline because I'm not trying to end up in your book. Like she going to go and do a story tell all. With Kim Kardashian, it's going to be different. Bro, you know it, bro, she business minded. But, she gonna think you and see don't, shit through. But you don't marry. Brandy Renner has the same opportunity, bro. To you do the don't same marry thing, neither though. one of them, though. But you she, don't marry them. That's what I'm saying. You don't marry you them. You can't help who you fall in love with. If you meet somebody, if you meet somebody randomly, Q, we, Q, we, if we take a jet and we and me, you and Jalen go to motherfucking This is not random, Paris. though. This is Kim we Kardashian. Go to Paris. We go to Paris for a week, and we meet. A female. Each of us meet a female that we that we yeah, just like. Yeah, yeah like just listen, like, I'm like yeah. She dope. Hold I want to. I want to I wanna try to connect her. And she may have a high ass body. Hold up. You hold can't up. help with the heart. Hold walk, up, bro. No, there's a difference. Money bag. Money bag. Yayo said, "I don't care who you have before me." Yeah. No, he we said. He okay, said. Okay. Okay. So then we said it's so Scorpio. So, <laughs> Scorpio. So let me ask a simple question then. Since, since since y'all don't care about body count, <laughs> this should be a very simple question. So you would be don't, cool. Bro, it don't matter, bro. Chill. I can't even lie. No, you, so you would be you cool. Heard it first. You would be body cool count, bro. with marrying a girl who has knocked me and Clyde. No, because, that's different. Because that's Kim Kardashian. That's, no, different. Let me that's make, different. That's bro. different. Bro. Kim Kardashian has slept with people who Kanye run into all the time. No, bro. not run into. Nigga, we more than just niggas who run into each other, though. We, oh, exactly. That's don't know. different. Bro, Kanye is around the game. He's done songs with them. He slept with her. 50 Cent and all of them, all of these dudes in the NBA, he is rubbing shoulders. Listen, listen, listen. No, 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 no. Why, bro? But that's an industry. Bro, I mean, he is rubbing bro. shoulders with them. They you are in the same. Oh, you can't say that. So bro. you are. That's cool. like saying you wouldn't date a girl okay. in high school because she was around niggas in high school. No, I'm not saying around. See, that's a nuance. No, she, I'm not saying her. Okay, nigga. No. Okay, okay. okay let's and high school girls let's are sleeping track. around, nigga. You're in my circle, bro. Let's backtrack. You we, not so, so, like, so, so, that's come what I'm on, saying. Bro. Okay, like, so like, that yeah, nigga that in my yeah, circle. Yeah, yeah, I had to say it, but if that nigga that in my circle and I be at the club and I see Kim Kardashian, see that's the thing. We're not just talking about the club. These people were in his inner circle. These are people he has to work with on a regular. But you don't gotta be in my circle with me to work with you. Thank you, bro. Listen. So you would be cool with having to work. On a regular basis with some with people, not one person, because it's different. Well, I'm Kanye West. I don't have to do nothing. Yes, you do. No, I'm Kanye because West. Because the top dogs are the top dogs in the game. You're gonna rub elbows with them, or you could just be petty. No, or you can be enemies. Way. That's like him but and the, Drake. Yes, but he thought that Drake slept with her on the back end. The point is, for example, him and Game did a song together when he was with Kim. Everybody know Game. I ain't gonna lie, that shit go hard too. It does. It okay, goes super hard. That was okay. It's but look, but that's, but the that's the genius side. But you that's the genius side because most of us. Most cool motherfuckers would simple. never do that shit. It's so the fact that Kanye is like, and hey, he got I'm the not, sex no, tape with her. I'm the, asking you. The fact that I'm, I'm not the same you. man would as you Kanye be was. Cool with it or not? That's a simple. I would yes not no. be on a song. Okay, with this what the nigga fuck? Shout out to his about. new girl though, cause she bad as fuck. Yeah, she'll be there for a week too. She got. The oh, yeah, they all get the paid. meter is running. The cab outside the meter running. No, but what I'm saying is, but what I'm saying is, is if she hooked up with. Slept with, had relations with any nigga or any person in my circle. There's no chance of her being my girl. So you don't think that game if, and him are cool on in the same circle when him and Kanye is super cool? Like but that. you're taking the word circle. When I say circle, I'm talking about my my boys. You my do game. know yeah. the game and Kanye are super close and super cool. But super close. You nigga. do know that they super close so much so that when the game asks about it, who, by the way, is one of the most disrespectful motherfuckers on the planet, that he refused to talk about it just because nah, that's his think boy. Think about it. Think about but it. That's the game and from Kanye. The game. It don't matter. He's in the circle that y'all just was talking about. Okay, but. But Kanye already accepted the fact that the game had her first, so he good with it. Oh, all I know is y'all. I out. wouldn't do that. I'm the type of nigga that I have her first, and if a nigga want to have her afterwards, like, Listen, if that's I'm you, not brother, that's you. Have her. I'm talking about marrying her. He married somebody I know that. who who knocked niggas in his. You circle. ain't never had it. Have you never? No, hold on, never, hold on, never, hold on. Never, nigga, have wallow, y'all, have, he on a wallow never, ball. have y'all never, ever? Never, y'all never had a girl that you got with, and then she start talking to your friend? No. My boys don't even do that shit. We don't move that. Mine that switch shit, to the other side. That shit awkward. Bro. I had two that do that switch to the other side. What do you mean switch to the other side? Like went to some girls to experiment. Oh no, I'm talking about niggas. But I'm talking I about dudes. I didn't. I mean, I'm talking about I. I it might have been a one night thing or like a quick fling. Like we was maybe wasn't serious. Like she wasn't my girlfriend. Oh, I ain't nah. had no one night stand. I ain't did that. You've never done that. I've never had a one night stand, bro. Never. What the fuck? What the what? <laughs> 
Never, uh, <laughs> I ain't never had a one night stand, bro. bro. These shits be going I be so picky. Left. I be picky. Hold I be up, picky up, with my. Up. I be picky with my cat, bro. Stop. 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 Will you uh, hold on. Clyde. I'm picky with the cat, bro. So hold and up. Looks all right. All right. So when you say one night stand, do you mean you didn't hit on the first night, or one night stand like you just hit it once and that was it? Nah, like I didn't hit on the first night. You ain't never. Wait, hit you on never hit on the first night. Whoa. Opportunity. Whoa. 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 Stop. Stop. Night? Stop. You've never hit on the first night. Never. Never, bro. You, would, a, you a gentleman. Dude. Wouldn't get far. Oh my god! Yo, shut the fuck up. Nah, bro. I just, it just, it, it for me, for me, it, it did more so Hold like. Up.